Okay, hey guys. So, um, yesterday, very excitingly, I got my, um, Secure Koi, um, Pocket Field watercolor set. Um, and this is the 24 color set. Um, and so I'm going to be doing a color chart. Um, so put my palette aside. I'm not going to be using the water brush, not because I don't want to, it's just I've already got a bowl of water here so I'm just going to be using my normal Faber-Castell brush. So I've got a piece of paper here and I'll just zoom in a little bit. Just got a new grid map so I'm, uh, grid mat so I'm still trying to um, get the spacing right with the camera and everything. Um, so I've divided it up into 24 squares. Um, so I'm just going to start filling them in and yeah, thought I'd bring you guys along. So as you can see, I have finished um, doing the color swatch. I'm just going to zoom out. So I'll just move this to the side. I'm just trying not to touch the wet bits. And then I'm going to bring... Um, so I wasn't mixing any colors. I was just using the original 24. Um, and I forgot to mention before I started the video, this is um, Arches 100% cotton um, watercolor paper. And it's 185 GSM. Um, and this was just an off cut I had um, because the pads, the pad of paper that I generally use when making my cards is A5. I generally cut the piece of paper in half, and so then I get generally like roughly this size um, left over. And so I just used one of the leftover pieces from my card. Um, I checked it beforehand, and it just happens to fit nicely in here. Um, so I'm just going to let this piece dry um, completely and then I'll be storing it in here and this way I have an accurate representation of what the colours look like when they're mixed because as you can tell some of them don't look quite like they do like I thought this was a black um, and here in the bottom right it's actually dark brown and this one's the black and um, yeah like this one looks like a like chocolate brown but it's like this really bright pink, so <laughs> I think it's really good to do um, a colour test when you first get new paints, um, or any medium for that matter. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.